Hi, Hi Dr. Felix. Hello, How thanks are you? for coming. Let me get you a cup of tea. Yeah, okay. The hashtag age better, right, is like a treatment philosophy. Basically, in the olden times, 10 years ago, ladies only got two choices. Either they look old and haggard, or they look fake and plastic. There's no in-between spot. But now, right, with the way we do our aesthetic treatments, we can actually make their faces change slower with age. So, over time, they actually look like a younger, better version of themselves. So if you imagine that you have a magic wand, what would you change on your face? Three priorities. I would like to look 20 years younger. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> also like to wake up and have that radiant glow on my face without any makeup. So if you if you think about it in an oversimplified way, right? You imagine this is a retaining ligament. Yep. On it, right, is fat. So th when you're young, this is tightly held, the fat is in place, you have this high rounded fullness. And as you age, right, the ligament starts to set on one side and the fat starts to slide down. Mm. So now you have a hollow over here and you have a weight over here. So previously, aesthetic treatment is like fillers is to fill hollows. So this happens, they fill the hollow up. So then the cheek gets fuller and the patient looks younger. The problem is that the underlying problem is not soft. Eventually everything starts dropping again. So what you do is you fill it again. And then it drops and you fill and it drops. And then you fill more and more and more and over and over again. They just have to look puffy. Versus what we do nowadays, right, is instead of filling the hollow, we support the ligament. Our fillers are actually here. So then it lifts the ligament up, which will make this weight lighter. And this thing just goes up, right? And the hollow is actually filled by your own fat. And this is the most natural way to kind of rejuvenate a face. So basically, uh, over here we use predominantly Juvederm fillers. Um, Voli, Volif, Voluma and Volux, right? They are basically cousins of each other. They are made from the same type of hyaluronic acid but with different levels of cross-linkage to make it from very, very soft like Volite to very, very hard like Volux. And the most common one would be Voluma, which is in between. Looking back at this, what do you think we can do to improve your skin? I think it's mostly like the the pores are quite big. Mm. And then like there's like maybe some acne scars mm. or like the yeah, pigmentation. Mm. Yeah, those minor ones I think. Yeah, it, actually it's true, it's true. Yeah. So so in your case we are not actually trying to fix a problem. We are trying to make your skin better. Yeah. Which is actually much more difficult. The good thing is that we have the Picocher device. So what the laser can do that's different from what people may have in their minds of what lasers do usually, right, is basically the collagen effect. What the Picocher does that's really, really special is that it punches little bubbles under the skin. Mm -hmm. So these bubbles is damaged, so it makes your skin want to repair them. Mm -hmm. So then it triggers that cascade of, of, of repair that makes new collagen in your skin. And this collagen, right, holds water. When it does that, the skin is firmer, it's stronger basically, it's more resilient to aging. And what you see, the difference is that when you feel your skin, it's smoother. When you look, it's smoother. The lines, the pores are better. It was very gentle and very comfortable and my face feels very clean and fresh. For me, the main motivation was to feel more confident about myself. I'm actually a working mom, mom um, of three kids. So for me to actually look young and beautiful, it's very important. But to actually uh, feel beautiful inside out, I think that's also very important. Uh, enhancing our best assets is always in vogue. In terms of pain, I would say very, very minimal. One about 1.10. Uh, it felt more like an itch. Everything was very, very comfortable. 
Dr. Felix actually explained everything. The barriers for guys sitting at said treatment in the past was seen as feminine, but right now, having beautiful skin, you know, looking good is not just for a single gender. It, it applies to guys and girls as well. 